On average, every person owns around 10,000 things and most of the things don't even have a material value and yet they take up time. Especially now that cheap priced products are being offered in abundance to people. Develop an awareness of things and give them a special appreciation in order to recognize what you really need. That's hard. Damn hard. I want to use a wardrobe and remove all of our apartment to do just that. Say goodbye to stuff I don't need. Kapia is already busy packing and I have an appointment at a doctor and I should leave right now in this second but I don't know if I should cancel the appointment or not. So I made this appointment a couple of weeks ago because of the mold in my apartment and I can't breathe that easy but I don't have any more problems. What should I do? Should I cancel the appointment or not? Yeah, I should cancel. I mean, if I would cancel the appointment, we both had some time together to pack. Otherwise, everyone needs to pack separated because later on I have to work. Tomorrow she isn't at home. On Sunday she has to work. <sighs> they are not taking the call. Mm. So I tried to call him and to cancel the appointment, but I couldn't reach anyone, which means, honey, we can spend some time now together, packing. Okay, now it's a little bit escalating here because we are throwing so much away not only clothing also our shoes I don't have that much shoes but for example these here are I mean and trash and it's so much stuff mm -hmm. What shall we do? What shall I do with these shoes? I don't know. Ooh, business shoes. Even more shoes. So in the last years, so much stuff has accumulated, which needs to go. So we ran out of duct tape. I need to find one and I hope we have one in the car or in the basement. Do we have one in the car or in the basement? What do you think? So I couldn't find anything in the car. Just hope that we have something in the basement. Do we not have more duct tape? Oh. Found one! Oh. 
Hier. It was definitely not planned that we pack today so much stuff. Honey, we don't move out today, just in two weeks, not today. Yeah, just saying. It's <sighs> okay. I don't know what to do with these books. Shall I donate them or? So that was definitely not planned that way. We packed so much today and a lot of stuff which can go. It is more chaos than before, honey. Yeah. Trash can go. We packed here. Several boxes, jeans from Fabienne, clothing from Fabienne, shoes from Fabienne and me, mostly Fabienne's shoes. We have here, what is this? Clothing Fabienne. You have so much clothing. Clothing Fabienne and pictures. It feels so empty here right now in our apartment. Look at the cabinet. Everything is gone. Already packed here. Trash as well. What is this? Ah, books. Books I want to donate because I don't need them anymore. Sport related stuff. And it's just overall a big chaos right now. And our bedroom doesn't look better at all. What is here worth the closing? This is this was really big. So, what do you want to sell? Yeah. Okay. And this is closing. I don't need anymore. I will. Give this my brother or my father maybe, or I will donate it because it's still good. But it doesn't fit me anymore, so... Just two weeks left for our move out. Just two weeks. Honey, how do you feel about that? Hmm. Just two weeks left? Yeah, good. What? Good. Good? Yeah. Why? But it's not a little bit sad to... I mean, we lived here for four years now. That's right. Bye bye. So it is now quarter past one. I have to work in the gym at three. It's Friday, I am always working in the gym on Fridays. And because we packed so much today, I also got these books here left, which I don't need anymore. So sport related, fitness related books. I wanna give them to my colleagues in the gym, but I don't know how to handle all of that and this within the next 90 minutes. Oh, and I also want to get my workout in, in before. So I really don't know how this could happen. It's now already two. I got just one hour left to have my workout and until I have to work. So I need to rush. So I only got left. Let's go. Since yesterday we have new regulations here in Germany which says that in a gym and in bars and restaurants it's just allowed if you're vaccinated, recovered from COVID-19 or tested but just tested with a so-called PCR test which costs approximately around 50 up to 70 euros. So the gym is going to be quite empty today I guess. So I don't know what today holds because it is already half past three and I have to be at the counter for the whole nine hours. Right? What are you doing? <laughs> just talking to the camera. No, I just said that we have to be at the counter for the whole shift, right? Yeah. We have to be present and check if every got yeah, yeah, every tested. Time. So it's so... It's so uh... mm, I'm not looking forward to it. Yeah. How was your shift? 
Oh, it's so difficult and <laughs> yeah, a lot of work. Today did not go out as originally planned, but it was the first day saying goodbye to things I don't need. And it feels great. Yeah, I got something for you guys. Hey, what's up, for you? I got something for you. Ah, Presents for you. Books. Junge, niemand mag Bücher. They don't appreciate the books I wanted to make. What's the deal, Junge?